hey guys welcome back to my channel today i am going to be showing you guys another t-shirt video this one is an svg that i uploaded from etsy i think i got it for like three dollars and i figured it would be perfect to do leo since it is currently cancer season but by the time i um put this out it will be going into leo season so we might as well get ahead of it so let me just make this a little smaller for you guys so you can see the full picture and so if you can't already see it says leo girl magic and it has a woman with an afro inside of the words which i thought was really really dope especially for a black woman so what i'm going to do now is go ahead and separate the SVG, ungroup it so that each layer is its own layer. And then I'm going to go to contour here and I'm going to go down to the lips and I'm going to highlight it. This is so that we can take the lips off of the picture and print them as a separate cut so that I can make the lips red. So now what I'm going to do is go ahead and hit continue. I'm sorry, make it. As you can see, it has two different cuts because I have two different colors. I have gold for the letters and I have black for the inside picture and the word magic. And so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna make sure that our project is mirrored then we're going to make sure that our vinyl is on our mat shiny side down make sure to check all your settings as always now we can go ahead and print so I decided to separate the word magic from the picture because I didn't have enough vinyl to make it all on one sheet but we're going to go ahead and uh, print the word magic and the lips of course making sure that everything is mirrored again for this part and now we can continue after mirroring and start this part of the project now we're going to go ahead and weed out the word magic this was really difficult to do because of all the little intricate cuts in between the words in each letter it was really tedious but the end result was definitely worth it so I'm going to get the rest of this done and then I will show you how I pressed it so as you can see I have my first layer already on the shirt I have my other layers cut out and ready to go see how the magic came out and I am going to just set these all to the side until I am ready to use them. And um, you want to first press the first layer down and then you can maneuver all the other pieces in between so that you get the perfect picture at the end. And so I'm going to take my Teflon sheet, of course, and press this down I haven't used my machine in so long <laughs> so it's kind of dusty so now that we have that press we're going to go ahead and peel our backing off our transfer sheet nice and easy here with heat transfer vinyl I usually um, try to press it at least two times so that it could be really in there but since I'm doing several layers I'm not going to worry about that because it will get pressed with each layer so um, I'm going to lay this down just to get a feel for how I want it to look and um, I think what I'm going to do actually is cut around the design so that I don't get any lines in my gold vinyl that I already placed. And 
and so now I'm going to put it perfectly into the space that is cut out for it here and just adjust it accordingly and you want to make sure you get any lint or anything that may be on the back off so that it doesn't get pressed under your design and once you have it where you want it you put your teflon sheet on top and the weight will hold your design down and then you just go ahead and press that layer as well i'm just going to check to make sure that it hasn't come away from where i want it to be Perfect, so now we can press. All right, so we have our second layer pressed here. It's really hot, so just be very careful and peel it off carefully just to make sure that, you know, nothing lifts. And it's perfect. And there is a little bit of a line still around the design on the gold vinyl, but we'll fix that by pressing it at the end. Um, I wouldn't worry about it too much. Now we're going to move on to the lips. I really like these because they are a glitter gold. I thought they were perfect for this design. We're just going to lay it in there like we did the afro. And um, we're going to make sure that we have it placed perfectly in between the lines. And press. Now that we have all three layers on, it looks perfect. I just wanna make sure that I peel the top sheet off here. And we're going to prepare to put our word magic at the bottom in that open space. Remember to cut out the transfer sheet around the word so that you don't get the crease in your gold vinyl. And so now we're going to press all of it one last time just to make sure everything is sealed in. And so this is what it looks like when it all comes together. I love the way that it turned out. I love the gold and the red and black combination together. It, I think it looks absolutely beautiful. Um, those letters though for magic were hard to weed out but it was well worth it. And this is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video today. Please let me know what you think in the comment section down below. And as always, if you could like, share, and subscribe, I would really appreciate it. Thank you guys for watching.